As part of this section, we'll talk about getting started with Spark SQL. Actual Spark SQL content will be available as part of the subsequent sections. In this, we'll just see how to get started. It's very important to understand the documentation so that we can access the material quickly. So we'll uh, actually cover all your Spark documentation as first topic in getting started. Then we will understand how to launch Spark SQL and run uh, commands using CLI. The commands include create table, create uh, database, drop table, drop database, etc. Then we'll actually get into the details with respect to Spark SQL properties. Also, we'll understand how to run OS commands such as ls lt or HDFS DFS ls to get the uh, details about files in HDFS and so forth using Spark SQL. They are all nothing but OS commands. On top of Spark SQL commands, we should be able to run OS commands also, and we will see those details as part of that fourth topic called as running OS commands using Spark SQL. Then we'll talk about uh, understanding warehouse directory. Warehouse directory is the base directory for the Spark databases or Spark SQL databases, and hence it is very important for us to understand about it. Then we'll talk about uh, managing Spark Metastore databases, then uh, Spark Metastore tables. This is where we'll actually get started with uh, Spark SQL a bit in depth. Once we understand how to manage Spark Metastore databases as well as Spark Metastore tables, we'll understand how to retrieve metadata of these tables. Then we will actually talk about Spark Metastore or Heavy Metastore role in uh, building the databases using uh, big data ecosystem. So these are the topics which will be covered as part of the getting started. This is just to get started with Spark SQL. The actual content related to DDL, DML, which are primarily to create tables, uh, load data into the tables, and also writing queries against those tables will be covered as part of subsequent uh, sections. So stay tuned for the, the topics related to this section and also the subsequent sections.